I grew up on the southwest side of Chicago in this really weird neighborhood. Uh, it was just a, a neighborhood that was just all cemeteries and bars. <laughs> yeah, like I grew up somewhere that's just founded on not handling shit well. And people like to ask me what it's like to grow up there, and I like to describe it as, um, picture two white women fighting at a carnival, but that's not a metaphor. That's just happening a lot. Like, enough to be, like, if we had a flag, it would be that and an Arby's logo. Uh, you know, because you're hanging out at the carnival, you're playing that game where you pop a balloon and win a Coke mirror. Um, Right, okay, yeah, I'm not crazy. When I was a, for some reason, when I was a kid, all the prizes of the carnival were like a stuffed animal, normal, uh, goldfish, throw the ping pong ball, but then there's these little mirrors with like cartoon characters and shit on them. Those were Coke mirrors, folks. Uh, kids aren't into mirrors. That's not a thing kids have ever liked. Like, that was someone at the end of the 80s had a warehouse full of Coke mirrors. And he was like, well, shit. Uh, I guess we'll just slap a Batman on it and see what happens. I don't know, like, like that's even a cokehead's plan. He's like, we're taking the mirrors. We're putting cartoon characters on. We're taking them to the carnival. Give the kids darts, fucking whole wall balloons. <laughs> fucking pop them, get them, live forever. Cha-ching, bitch, bam. That's why your dad always took you to that game. He's like, we're the one with the Van Halen logo. Hell yeah. Nice.